picking up right where we left off yesterday in the nether. Um, did find the fortress. Took us forever. Did not know we sat down there before. It's a dangerous place this time. This nether. There are evil bug things somewhere in that general direction. We're trying to avoid them. They shouldn't be in the warped. <laughs> There's a place right there. Seemingly no way to get up here. Try to go. There's a few of them. Oh, oh, wait, I'm immune to fire. Walk right up and say, Yoink! <laughs> Mission accomplished already. So we could now you know, just try to get out of here. Totally, uh, you know, an option that we could pursue, or we could spend some time. There's like eight withers here. Could you? <laughs> He's trying to shoot me in the back. I could stop missing my swings. Alright, we got some uh, necrotic bones out of that. These toasted walnuts. Alright, well, it looks like we got, you know, the lamest possible, um, fortress. That shouldn't be too surprising after, you know, all the time that we spent looking for it. There's a million of those guys over there again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shoot me all you want. Alright, well, you actually can deal damage to me. Given that he has that bow. They're all spawning down there for some reason. I'm having a feeling that there's not going to be an interior. So if you look at the journey map, right? As any good uh, Minecrafter will know, fortresses spawn on the north and south axis. Axis, not axis. So in theory, We do need to kind of head, you know, south a ways here to get back home anyway. We 
Drop. Oh, yeah, you drop bears. Look, there's two more of them. They drop into the lava. Are they immune to lava? They appear to be. That one's got his whole head stuck in it. You gotta be careful of the bone dragons, though. That was a very lame nether fortress. There's just a million drop bears everywhere. Getting back to the portal. It's actually going to be... You know... Kind of painful. And why is every location... In this... <laughs> These stupid basalt deltas where there's the bone dragon behind me and in front of me. As we learned, they can and will jump up onto land. <laughs> like that. Alright, unfortunately, our trip to the nether turned out to be, ow, pretty lame. This isn't helpful. Hi. How's it going, Bone Dragon? I think we do have to go up this way. I think we just have to bridge ourselves. And jump out of the... No? It's not going to jump out this time. Go this way. I don't think there's any reason to try to fight this guy. Never mind. They're like super easy to kill. If we had like any kind of armor. We could honestly, well, actually, also, oh my god. <laughs> I've got limited blocks. I don't want to use them all up trying to jump back up the mountainside here. But I also have limited picter ability, so I don't want to waste that. But we did get, like, you know, the one and only reason that we were coming in here. It's like, yeah, sure, if we could have gotten some other things, it would have been nice. But at the end of the day, we were only after filling our blaze heater. Now, in theory, I suppose, you know, we probably should have tried to get a couple more. Because we've got one, but like, you know, if we had two or three, potentially even more than that we might need, I don't know. I haven't gotten that far into create yet, so I don't know what, 
how many of these little things we're going to need. We closed the distance on the portal fairly quickly, though. So that's pretty good. Yes, thank you for giving me a bit of a booster there. I'm going to come back with some proper weaponry and like exterminate your whole species. That doesn't sound ominous at all. So I got 80 meters, but I think it's like almost exclusively upwards. I was afraid this was gonna happen. I do have 12 assault. Hi. Guys, don't even drop anything. Kidding me? Trying to get up out of here. Broke my shoes. Are you kidding me? There's another one. all the little baby ones flopping around. Why are there so many of you? Get off of me. Yep. <laughs> yep, saw that one coming. <sighs> we just probably lost so much of our stuff in the lava too. Because, of course, I landed on the ground. My stuff, probably not so much. My death, you know, should be marked in there. Um... Of course, the problem is we need, um, some fire, some form of fire resistance. We do not have that. I want to see something real quick. Can we use ropes? Like, can we throw them? No. Is there a way that we could potentially throw them. There are rope arrows. But like out of curiosity. But they are basically ladders. Alright. Well Of course, once again, trying to make a quick episode, and it's going to turn into a whole, whole ordeal here. We're gonna need to start getting into that mod too so that we can get some stuff from there. Do have more ropes. I used to do it like this. I can't. Alright. It's about as good as that arrow's gonna get. Um, 
we still need sticks, which I suppose we can just make out of these. Guess they weren't, you know, none too happy that I killed a couple of them. But like I said, now that they've chosen war, I'm go back in. I don't have any other arrows, do I? Any hostile pets that we can use here? We could reverse the gravity of them. We don't have the feather fall pet, do we? Slow fall. Yeah, we do. All right. I'm gonna have to make more arrows. I can't. <laughs> So much flint. Feathers we can always get more of. I'm pretty sure my cats also give me feathers. I have some sticks already made. I should probably also make a pickaxe while I'm thinking about it. That's not where I click that. Eh, yeah, whatever. That works. Alright. Back into this we go. The piglins are invading the world. Of course, nothing better to do with their time. I am, of course, no longer immune to the fire, which is a big problem. Slow fall. Aha! Oh my gosh, we were nowhere near getting out of here. Oh my god, we're gonna get murdered again. Why are they, why are there 10 million of these guys? of them there are you kidding me well all that stuff's lost we have no way of getting that stuff well especially the stuff that I just got went in with because that all burned in lava but the other stuff that I had there is gone because I can't there's no way for me to even get close to it there's just like a hundred of those guys at that location. So, <laughs> once again, we're going to end the, the episode having done actually nothing but progress backwards. We can't even get our blaze spawner thing to heat up our stuff. I'm going to have to attempt tomorrow when I have more time to actually get in there and do something about it. But for now, we're ending here because I can't, I literally can't do anything about 500 straddlers in there. Well, <laughs> so, as usual, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you around for the next one.